Welcome to Whiskey's Journey. My name is Peter Fasciano, and in today's video, this is my Wednesday series called Sip It or Skip It. This is where I have all of my whiskeys randomized on my phone. I'm going to go ahead and spin the wheel, pull it off the shelf, give a quick review, and let you guys know if I'm going to keep sipping on it, and then when the bottle's gone, replace it, or if I'm going to skip it all together once the bottle's gone and not get it again. So let's go ahead and get onto the spin and see what we're doing for today. Westland single malt. Haven't had this one for a while. So let's get it off the shelf, pour it, and let's talk about it a little bit. All right, let's go ahead and get this poured, talked about, and then let you know if I'm going to replace the bottle or if I'm not going to. Also, I just need to let you guys know this series is not about me telling you guys how to spend your money. It's all about telling you guys how I'm gonna spend my money. Hopefully, as you guys go through my channel, if you notice that our tastes align, hopefully I'm gonna give you a little bit more information that gives you a better, I don't know, a better buying decision. So let's go ahead and get to know, get the nosing on this one. I've done a full review on this one previously, back in June, when I first started my video processing, or when I first started my videos. So if you're interested in the full review of this, Go ahead and go back and take a look at it after you watch this. Every time I have this one, it seems to present a little bit different each time. And here's my tally of my sippets and skippets so far. And here's all the information for this whiskey. There's a ton of different stuff going on with this one. Fruit forward with a little bit of spice. Get a little bit of chocolate now. This bottle has opened up a lot. Small amounts of tobacco, but I still do not get any peat on here at all. No smoke at all. Lots of barrel, lots of spice, and some sweetness. Let's go ahead and give it a taste. A little bit of apple sweetness, lots of chocolate, a little bit of a coffee note, still no peat. They do a bunch of different roastings, so I'm getting the roasted malt. Let's go ahead and get the second sip down. Chocolate, malt, apple, toffee, red apple, not green apple. Sweetness, nice spice, hints of a little bit of coffee. Let's go ahead and go for a third sip. I think you guys might know where I'm heading on this one. All right, I think I'm good. I have an opinion. So this is coming in at about $59, $60. I'm in Phoenix, Arizona. Am I going to keep sipping this? Absolutely, 100%, I am going to sip this. In fact, I am a huge fan of Westland. There's not a single expression that I have purchased from them that I'm disappointed in. This is now my sixth bottle. I've gone through their sixth edition, their fifth edition of the Gariana. I have the first and second edition of the Collier, and then I have this bottle. Everything from them has been fantastic. So this is definitely a sip it for me. That's pretty much it. That's what the series is all about. These quick hitters, letting you guys know what I think about the whiskey, give you quick tasting notes, and then let you go. So if you guys are liking this information, go ahead and leave some comments down below. If you're not subscribed to the channel, go ahead and subscribe. Give me a like while you're at it if you are so inclined. If you know anybody in the whiskey world that would be interested in this content, go ahead and share it with them. And until the next time, enjoy your journey. We'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Big fan of this one. Big fan of this one. I can sip it all day. All day. Mm. Talk to you guys next time.